If you want to build a twin tower on the south bank of the Qiantong River, it will become a new city skyline. In order not to affect the normal airway, you set the height at about 300 meters. But the appearance of the traditional twin towers is more ordinary, not in line with the landmark building you want to create. So smart you took the inspiration of H, changed the tower to a cylindrical shape, and punched hundreds of concrete up to 80 meters deep into the foundation. After installing the machine, connect the corridor between the two towers. This is an H shape from the front. To improve the wind resistance, you designed the tower body into a thick and thin structure, lowered the center of gravity, and designed the inner part into a streamlined tower body. Even in the face of strong winds, the curved structure can reduce a lot of load, but the streamlined tower body will generate lateral thrust. So you install a ring of steel skeleton suspension every 10 floors inside the tower, just like a belt solitary injection tower to counteract the horizontal force. However, the special structure of the beam tower will cause the center of gravity to be closed inward, and long-term windswing will cause the corridor to break. Therefore, Smart has used the traditional arch bridge to borrow force to add steel skeletons between the beam towers to form a saddle shape. The curved surface design can disperse the wind pressure from all directions. In order to enjoy the beautiful scenery of Qiantang River indoors, you add a glass curtain wall on the outside, and then insert shading louvers in the glass interlayer which can be automatically adjusted according to the sun angle. Congratulations on successfully building the gate of Hangzhou.